The people who run the restaurants, the grills, the bistros here on Sanibel and Captiva say they are seeing and seating more people on Sundays. Sunday started out really good with people coming over the causeway at the Knoll Toll. Rich noted the free trip on the causeway has led to turning more tables, a common theme from the people we've talked to. Sunday has been one of the highest um, since they, um, they waived the toll. On Sunday. First Sunday when they waived the tolls, um, business went up to 35 percent. And since then, um, Sundays have been the busiest day for us. Leal is also optimistic about the upcoming grand reopening of the Green Flash on Captiva on September 22nd, which is also the weekend of the Songwriter Festival here on the island for another Sunday with no tolls on the causeway. You know, like a lot of like customers that come in from Fort Myers, all over Fort Myers, you know, and um, they usually come here because they see their no tolls. Despite the intense and ongoing recovery efforts, businesses extend their invitations, saying they need visitors now more than ever. On Sanibel, everybody says to me that they don't want you out here. We want you out here. We want you to come out and enjoy Sanibel. Have a good time in Sanibel. Go to While the toll booths aren't taking that revenue on Sundays, six bucks with each passing car, Sanibel businesses say they are working those long hours to be ready for the busy season, especially as the lost fall and winter of last year. Reporting from Sanibel, Anvar Bruziev, Fox 4.